Our persons of the week. It's Oscar weekend. Everyone will be talking about it, and two of Hollywood's biggest wattage stars are getting ready to walk the high wire of comedy. We wonder tonight, with hundreds and hundreds of millions of people getting ready to watch, how do they feel? So there are persons of the week. You might not remember what Julia Roberts wore, or Gwyneth Paltrow, or who won for Best Supporting Actor. Here's your host for the... But the minute the Oscar hosts appear on stage, it's as if we're all right up there, too. Ladies and gentlemen, one of the most talented and funniest motion picture actors of the last 40 years. Wow. Then my introduction is, ladies and gentlemen, Alec Baldwin. <laughs> and now, for the first time in 23 years, the Academy Awards hosting will be handled by two people. I've uh, hosted uh, twice before alone, and they felt I needed help. It's a high-wire assignment. All of us at home deciding whether they're funny or not. All of us thinking we know everything there is to know about movies. But neither Alec Baldwin nor Steve Martin needed this job. They're doing it for the joy. I think the Oscars are going to be intelligent, charming, yes. mm -hmm. urbane. Yes, and then we'll be there. And then we walk out. <laughs> One, a kid from a big Irish family. The other, a kid who grew up in California, famously working at Disneyland. Well, when Steve hosted, when I was a little boy, um, <laughs> it was so exciting for me, and I'm thrilled to be doing this with him now. Yeah. And, um, uh, well, I, I, my first uh, show, the uh, first time I saw them was when Mark Twain hosted. <laughs> <laughs> a measure of what it takes out of you, Billy Crystal, with his legendary opening numbers, has hosted eight times, but said it's tough. Oscar, Oscar, Oscar. That hosting the Oscars is like making love to a beautiful woman. It's something I only get to do when Billy Crystal is out of town. There are cautionary lessons I'd from like other to. hosts. Be wicked, a little wicked, even with your glamorous colleagues. I see a lot of new faces, especially on the old faces. And remember, Bob Hope did it 19 times. Welcome to the Academy Awards, or as, as it's known at my house, Passover. Who's gonna win? I sent an email asking what they're doing to get ready for Sunday night. Steve Martin wrote back, I'm trying to tame Alec Baldwin with a whip and a chair. So what's the biggest surprise about Baldwin, I ask him? He's better with a whip and a chair than I am. So here's to the two guys working tonight and tomorrow and Sunday night on the tricky task of taking our time-honored tradition and making it new and making us laugh.